Hi, I'm Barbara. Welcome to Barbara Bakes. If it's your first time here, thank you for joining us. I'm glad you've stopped by. Watch the video, of course, and don't forget to subscribe when you've finished. If you've read the title, and I'm sure you have, you'll know that today we're making easy keto blueberry muffins. You can have them for breakfast, a snack in the afternoon, whenever you want, really. Just watch those macros, especially with the blueberries. Make sure that you weigh them correctly so that you don't go over. So grab your notepads, your laptops, your recipe books, wherever you keep your recipes, and let's make some blueberry muffins. I have a large bowl here, and to that I'm adding all my dry ingredients, which includes my almond flour, my erythritol, sea salt, just a touch, bicarb and baking powder, and of course you might know bicarb as baking soda. Give that a little whisk, just to blend everything together nicely. There we go. And we're going to start to add the wet ingredients, which will include coconut oil, almond milk, vanilla, and a touch of apple cider vinegar, which is optional. And lastly, whisk your eggs before you pour those in and give that a good whisk. If you find that it's too stiff, not a problem. You can add a touch more almond milk and I'll show you the consistency you want it. Nice, easy recipe and you can give it a personal touch. And this is something that you can add as well. It's an optional extra just to give your muffins a bit of zing. It's orange zest and of course you can use lemon zest if you prefer. And just add your zest, whichever one you're using, to your batter with your blueberries. Lemon or orange and blueberry go really nice together. And as you can see, I'm, I'm not mixing it really hard. I'm just folding over to incorporate the orange and the blueberries evenly into the batter. There we go, I'm ready for the cupcake papers. Now I have a four centimetre scoop. It's an ice cream scoop. If you've got about a six centimetre scoop, that would be perfect. This is a little small, so I'm going to scoop all my buns and then go back afterwards and fill them up a little bit so that you get a nice sized bun without it being too big. And of course, all the macros will be in the description box with the ingredients list. These are looking delicious. Now we've finished scooping, we're going to head to the oven to pop them in for 20 to 25 minutes. If you have a skewer, check on 20 minutes, put your skewer in. If it comes out clean and dry, you know they're ready, take them out of the oven and cool them in the tins. So the muffins are out of the oven, they're nice and cool. Let's take a look inside. Now, you may think that these are beautiful as they are, and of course, we can just leave them there. But you know me, I need to give you something a little bit extra. This is erythritol crystals, and all we're going to do, just give them that bakery coffee shop look. Just press it in, knock off the excess, and there you have it. Either way, they both look delicious, they both taste delicious, you choose. That was a nice easy one for you, wasn't it? As I said before, all the ingredients will be in the description box below with full macros as well. Don't forget to subscribe, put your notifications on and comment in the box. If you love the recipe, share it with your friends and so that they can come to our channel too. Thank you for watching. See you next time.